Okay, you have been in Lithuania eight years uh, ago, I think so. Uh, do you find any differences uh, then and now? Well, I've been here uh, the last time, it was three and a half years ago, when I was with, uh, with uh, Neptunus, and eight years ago with Ritas. And from the first time, it's uh, a lot of differences. I, I think the, the country has uh, grown. Uh, the love for the sports uh, continues. And it's a place that's been great to me and uh, basketball related. Uh, in media, in Lithuania, there were a lot of information about your decision. Where to go? To Vilnius? Come back to Vilnius? Or yeah. here in your... How it was actually? Well, it was... Uh, uh, over here, this team was very interested from the beginning um, and it was just a, a day before I had to make the decision of coming here when uh, Ritas came into the picture and uh, it, was, it wasn't easy, I'm not going to lie to you, it was a difficult uh, decision, especially because I have, I have friends on uh, uh, that team as well and, and I, I spoke to both coaches. Uh, so it was more of a, a decision based on the situation that I'm in right now and taking up on a, on a, on a challenge. So I'm, I'm happy where I'm at now and excited for what was coming. Okay, uh, after a few, a few years, uh, after Lithuania, you have played in Turkey. Uh, could you compare those basketball leagues, the, the main differences? Well, um, they both really good. Um, I think having more uh, Euroleague teams uh, made Turkey uh, a very strong league. Also, going there was, was amazing. I think uh, Ritas gave me that step, you know, to, 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 to be in that, in that league and being able to, to win my second championship in Europe. So, you know, I've been, I've been blessed. Uh, I think both leagues have been, been great to me. Uh, but this league always helps me to get to uh, another level. And now, when you are 36 years old, uh, what's, your, what's your plans for the future? Or you're thinking about ending your basketball career? Or, or maybe it's back to Lithuanian Basketball League for the next step somewhere? Well, you know, I think uh, as athletes, we know this time as a, as a basketball players are, are short. And it all depends about how your body feels, uh, about the injuries. And I know a lot of guys that they think about retiring and then a year or two later, they decided, oh no, I wanna come back. I still have some in the tank. So I don't wanna get to that point. I wanna, uh, if I feel good, I will continue to play. Uh, but also I have a, a, a company back home. I have a foundation. So starting a, a clothing brand, I'm doing a lot of things. Uh, so either way, I think I'm fine. If I'm blessed enough to continue to play and, and help whatever team I'm in to win, then I will continue to do that. Okay, and uh, w one more thing, talking about the Rita's team, uh, when you are going to meet them in the court this season, will you have more motivation than uh, with other clubs? Yeah, well, I don't, I, I don't think I'll have more motivation. I give my motivation every day on myself when I'm working. Uh, it'll be nice to see some uh, familiar faces from the trainers to some of the players. Uh, actually, I think it'll be a good, a good feeling. Uh, but I won't see it as like, oh, this is the game we gotta. No, not at all. It's uh, for me, it'll be a, a, another game where I'll try to do my best and, and win. Okay. And about this team in Yonava, what do you see here? Uh, what can you say to fans? What to expect from this team this season? This first year in Lithuanian Basketball League, you are here now, so what we will, what, what we will see from, from your team? Yeah, well, from what I will give to the team, uh, uh, I think it will be that intensity and the, uh, wanting to do more and represent me and the team well. Um, I think we're going to work really hard. We're going to try to get the best results and that's what you can ask for for, for a team that just came up. I don't, I cannot tell you, listen, we're going to win all these games or anything. Like, I just know we're going to work hard and want to find a way to make the best out of the season. What can you say about head coach, Virginis? <laughs> I've seen, I've seen him, I know him from before. Uh, he gets a little excited. I think that's the uh, a right word. He gets a little excited in, in the games. He has so much passion 
uh, for, for the game, the, he, he, he gets a little excited, crazy uh, uh, during the games. But he's it's, it's a good guy. He's been treating me super nice. And he really showed that he wanted me to be here. What's uh, the best uh, advice for in the basketball you get some, uh, sometime? And what can you tell every basketball player and young players to give some advice in basketball? First, uh, to live in the moment and to have a, a short memory. I think uh, as, as individuals and as a basketball players, uh, we make a mistake and, and we focus too much on that mistake. Uh, when we talk about the specific game, let's say you make a turnover and, and the whole game you make it, you, you're thinking about that turnover. You, in basketball, you have to have a short memory. It's like you miss a shot, you already forget that you, that, that you missed a shot. If not, it's going to affect your next play. And for you to live in the present with good production in the future, you cannot be thinking about the past. So that's one advice that I got from a good coach and he's always helped me to make the best possession, the next possession, the best possession. Inside.